Alrighty guys, do you want a recipe that'll improve your psychic skill and spirit work? Then how about a plate of ratatouille? While it isn't as pretty as Remy's picture-perfect uh, Pinterest version of it, if you've seen the movie, you'll know that when Ego takes a bite, he's actually shot straight back into his childhood memories where his mother serves a very similar looking dish. Because ratatouille at its core is a French summer stew, making use of the best of all of your summer vegetables. As always, you can find this on my blog or join my Patreon, where you can of course vote on what topic we look at each month in our recipes. Once again, this month is Psychic Power, and eggplants, as you know, are a gorgeous purple fruit that are perfect for psychic power. There are four ingredients we're going to look at, the last one coming later. And this is technically vegan, but if you wanted to, I would suggest an Italian chicken sausage go in it. And did you know that eggplants have spikes? When you grow them yourself, it is a little painful if you don't know that. But nonetheless, to kick this dish off, all you're going to do is dice up all of these vegetables. The eggplant you're going to cook first for about 10 minutes to get it soft, because eggplant can be pretty bitter if you don't cook it right. Then once you have cooked all that up for a while, you're literally just gonna take it out and do the same with all the other ones. Remember to salt and pepper it really well and let it fry. And remember to dice your sausages into bite-sized pieces if you are using them. But once those eggplants are all done, you just take them out, put a little bit more olive oil in the pan and get frying all your other vegetables. You're gonna take those out later too. But while they're cooking, you can prep all of your herbs. Now normally with fresh herbs you don't want to put them in until the end because it can kind of lose some flavor otherwise, but since we're cooking them into the sauce, I figure it's fine to put them in a little earlier than I might. And taking time off the vine is super super annoying as you see here, so what we're going to do instead is we're just going to take this bundle and tie it up so we can easily take it out at the end. But once your zucchini and squash are all done, take those out and set them aside as well, and then cut up some onion and garlic, fry the onion until soft, and then cut up some tomatoes. If you're using sausage, throw them in once the onion is soft, and then add your garlic, add your crushed red pepper if you're using that. And from here on out, the rest is just throwing it all on in there. Then you're just going to leave it to simmer until the tomatoes break down about half an hour, and that is literally it. It is a very easy one-pot meal. So let's talk about that magic. Since we have eggplant, which is purple, again, all about psychic power and intuition, it is already great for psychic power. But when you combine it with the Roman funeral herb of parsley, as well as the Greek oracle herb of bay leaves, and of course, a standard bit of thyme, you not only have a great dish for psychic power, but specifically for spirit work, divination, giving messages, so on and so forth. Parsley especially is associated with mercury and air, making it a wonderful herb for that boundary between worlds and getting messages across. But once this has simmered enough, congratulations, all you gotta do is put it in a bowl and serve it with either bread or rice, whatever kind of starch you'd like. This was really good and the eggplant worked so well in this. So if you've been looking for a vegan, gluten-free, all that kind of stuff recipe, congratulations, you got one for psychic power.